Welcome back to episode 12, as we uncover the mystery of the relationship between Maurice Sam and Sonia Uche. In episode 11, we discussed the kind of marriage that Maurice and Sonia are involved in, whether it was a private marriage or a secret marriage. It seems to lean towards a secret marriage, as they are making superhuman efforts to keep things secret, despite the secret not being so much of a secret anymore. Unsolved Mysteries noted, for example, that Sonia went to extreme lengths to narrate a solo vacation trip. The constant reference to traveling solo and being alone definitely caught our attention. Despite Sonia insisting on being solo, we were happy to watch her on her day trip to Bimini, Bahamas. Let's examine the video. Okay, so this is 5.30 a.m. in Miami South Beach and I'm taking a one-day trip to Bimini, Bahamas. So for some of us who don't have a way of getting to the ferry, we're asked to come out to a bus stop and wait for the bus and the bus is going to come and take us to the ferry. And this is me out here wondering like, where is everyone? This is a city that is always filled with people, with activities and just name it. And I'm looking at the streets, I'm like, where is everyone? Yes, guys, like, yes, Miami Beach is a place filled with activities, with people, and just, just name it. So, I'm going to be here, the access to come out here, I'm going to be here and wait for the bus. Here we saw Sonia in Florida, in what seemed to be the early hours of the morning, before daybreak. Her footage showed her alone, with a couple of vehicles passing sporadically on the road. Is it our imagination, or does Sonia look strangely unconcerned and carefree, for a lone female standing about at night in a strange place in a foreign country? Was she really alone? Let's continue watching. So, so guys, we're to the <laughs> And this one is called Valeria Caribbean. Enjoy Bimini. Beach. Alright, this is what the interior of the boat looks like. There's a restaurant, people are getting comfortable in their seats, and some people are at the restaurant trying to get snacks, coffee, and what have you. Alright, oh, <laughs> so sorry. That one was making sure I didn't capture you. I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. I'm just trying to capture some stuff for you guys. Here Sonia showed footage of the inside of the Beleria ferry, which travels to Bimini, Bahamas. We note with interest that at no point did she show footage of herself on the vessel. We continue watching. Well, guys, it touched down Bimini, Bahamas. So all you need for this trip is your passport and yeah, I think just your passport. They have a card that will take you into the resort. And when you get in there, you just have to pay for your own cards to take you around the resort because where I might be going probably might just be different from where you are going to. So I rented the cards for like a hundred dollars. If I convert that money to Nigerian money, <clears throat> it's well. So, <laughs> guys, we're entering um, the resort. So when we got to the resort, I rented a cat for like hundred dollars and I went to the beach area. Yes, because I want to see the water. I actually felt like I would have been able to maybe get into the beach, get someone to record me, but honestly, I don't see anybody to record me. So I just had to enjoy myself in my little way. Here Sonia showed the complimentary tram ride which takes persons who enter the island from the dock. Again, she showed no footage of herself on this ride. One has to wonder, why is Sonia not showing herself on her trip? Here's what she showed us next. Yes, I'm driving to the beach now. Oh, Omo, see seats, see plenty of people. Oh, you both be pushing like enjoyment and I love it. I mean, everything shouldn't just be about walk, 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 walk. This advice is for me, yes. Everything about me, walk, 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 but I mean, let me enjoy myself too. <laughs> Alright guys, so I'm looking at the beach area and it's so, so beautiful. It's so, so 
beautiful i love it i love it here okay so guys let's go close to the water i mean the waves are something else let's go oh my goodness can you hear the sound of that can you hear the sound of that Show you guys look at look at Woo! I'll try and write my thing so no <laughs> so so is it our imagination or does it seem as if Sonia is the only person on the entire island? Or maybe Photoshop footage? We realize that there are many isolated beaches to be found in Bimini. Here she uses her toes to write a part of her name in the sand. We noted that this was the only time during the Bimini trip footage that we see her in the video. So, this was the extent of Sonia's Bimini day trip. A view of the ferry, a view from a tram, and a view of an empty beach. She really does not appear throughout the Bimini footage, which had us asking, why are we not seeing Sonia on the island? In the section of the footage with the empty beach chairs, we noticed that there was not another soul to be seen, not even the resort employees, yet she has photographs taken on the beach. We ask by who? Why go through such lengths just to avoid even a glimpse of her life partner? We had unsolved mysteries, were disappointed with the video, as a Bimini trip is so much more exciting and enticing. Sonia did say that she was unable to find someone to film her on her day trip, but we believe that her doing selfie photos and videos would have still given us a chance to see her as she experienced the island. She did have some footage of her trip which she did not include in her video. Let's see her in that video clip. Sonia was talking with this person who was recording her. Who could she have been talking to? She seemed comfortable with the person. In the video, Sonia went on to show her trip around Florida Bay. Here she shared that she got someone to film her. Let's see what she got. Hey guys, I'm really sorry I was not able to get some of the activities like um, the jet ski and the banana ride where we get to go on this floater that looks like a banana and then they just have to take us around and around on the water here they were just showing us um, some of the celebrity houses around this area and they also showed us um where the movie bad boys to watch shots I honestly did enjoy a lot of the activities, <laughs> yeah, I had fun and I got lucky, I got someone to record me at, like like you can see now. Yeah, but Was it our imagination or did Sonia seem comfortable with this particular stranger who she said she asked to film her? After all, a stranger might consent to taking a photograph or two but making a video and having a conversation? What do you think? There is so much more to see than meets the eyes. Was there anything that you also observed in this video? Stay tuned for another video, as we continue to investigate this vacation, which Sonia insists was a solo journey. This is the thing. With fame comes responsibility. With great fame comes even greater responsibility. As such, for those of us who are Sonia and Maurice fans, we celebrate all their milestones, so why so secretive? They do not have to share their entire lives with us, however. It's these things that they do, like the meltdown video and the solo vacation videos that invite scrutiny into their lives. Please subscribe to our channel, as well as like, share, and comment on our videos. Also support our favorites by subscribing to Maurice Sam TV and Sonia Che TV. Until our next episode.